Let us see our next interesting problem. It is given that the length of a rectangular plot is 20 meters more than its breadth. So, if the cost of fencing the plot at rupees 26.50 paise per meter is rupees 5300, then what will be the length of the plot in meters? So, we have to find the length of the plot. We have our options as A. 40 B. 50 C. Data inadequate and D. As none of these. So, what will be your answer? How to solve this? Let us see the logic behind. First, we have to assume that the breadth of the rectangular plot is x. Then using this, we have to calculate the perimeter of the plot. Then calculate the length by using the perimeter value. Let us see how to apply this logic to solve the problem. Assuming our length to be x plus 20, that is, your breadth is assumed to be x, so your length is 20 meters more than the breadth. Hence, x plus 20 will be the length. To find the perimeter of the rectangle, we are dividing a total cost of fencing, that is, rupees. 5300 with the cost of fencing per meter. So that gives you the perimeter of the rectangle which has been fenced. So 5300 divided by 26.50 will give you 200 meters. So that is the perimeter of the rectangle. Perimeter of a rectangle can be found using the formula 2 into L plus B that is your length plus breadth. Your length is nothing but x plus 20 plus your breadth is x. Substitute it and your perimeter is found out to be 200 over here. Solving this we get 2x plus 20 is equal to 100. 2x is nothing but 80. So, your x value is equal to 40. So, our answer is option A, 40. So, that will be the length of the plot in meters. Let us see our next interesting example. The length of a rectangle is half while its breadth is tripled. So what will be the percentage change in the area of the rectangle? So we have to find the percentage change in the area. Our options are given to be 25% increase, 50% increase, 50% decrease and 75% decrease. What will be our answer? Let us see how to solve this. So it is given that our original length, let us assume it to be x. And the length of the rectangle is half, so a new length will be x by 2, that is half of x. And it is given that the breadth is tripled. Let us assume the breadth of a rectangle to be y. And it is half by, whereas your breadth is tripled. So, your new breadth will be 3 times y. The original area is obtained by length into breadth. So that is nothing but 
x into y where is x y and a new length and new breadth is found out so a new area is nothing but length into breadth so new length is x by 2 multiplied by new breadth is 3y which is 3 by 2 xy to find the percentage increase in the area we have to subtract our original area from the new area divided by original area and multiplied by 100 since it's a percentage so that gives you a new area is nothing but 3 by 2 xy minus our original area that is xy divided by original area that is xy since we are going to find the percentage we are multiplying it by 100 taking 2 in LCM you get 3xy minus 2xy divided by 2xy that is nothing but xy by 2xy multiplied by 100 cancelling x, xy and xy terms you get 50 percentage so we have 50 percentage increase in the area after changing your new dimensions these pattern of questions appear in ibps cat exams